บายดี Hi everyone uh, Welcome to Gigi Lost Kitchen Today I'm gonna show you how to make Kwame Kwame is just like a you know for Thai dish it's called Pad Thai but this is like Laos it's we call Kwame okay so it's very really popular in Laos also so we're gonna use the rice noodle right here the rice noodle and then we have um, spring onion and carrot bean sprout cilantro and uh, sari this is good it's make it help it smell good and I'm gonna do the beef flavor today you can use beef or pork but I go for beef today okay and I have egg right here and this is all my seasoning I have fish salt oil water black uh, soy salt sugar and oyster salt salt and chicken flavor pepper and garlic and this is all the product that I use here. So it's going to be help you when you go grocery and find the product. Okay. So all this stuff right here is um, this one is oyster, oyster salt, fish salt, and this one is black soy salt. Okay. Salt and chicken flavor. Okay. Let's get started. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead turn my... Um, Pot high heat right here, and we're gonna go ahead and start putting the vegetable oil first. And I'm gonna save a little bit for my egg, okay? So, okay. Then go ahead and put sugar in after you put the oil. together while it's like not too hot yet if you put like the oil is super hot and you put the sugar in it's gonna be burned okay so you want to mix the oil and sugar the same time and uh, turn on the heat and slowly cook until the sugar melting and kind of like golden brown okay Like um, the sugar is melting, it's become like kind of like light brown right now. And you want to go ahead and put the garlic in, okay? And I'll wait until my garlic is become like a golden color, you know, kind of like yellow. Make sure that it's garlic completely cooked. Okay, that's look perfect right there. When it's look perfect, I go ahead and put the uh, black soy sauce in. Okay. And uh, oyster sauce. Start seasoning them. And chicken flavor. Black pepper. And a little salt. So I want to save some for my eggs. So I just put a little bit. Okay. And now I put all the seasoning in. And I'm going to go ahead and put the um, beef in. Now you want the beef to be cooked. So make sure the beef cook real good, okay? Okay, now my beef is start to cook and I go ahead and uh, prepare the water. This is just the water. The reason I put the water, you see in that, um, right here, the sugar stick on my spoon here, new spoon. And we want that to be melting too, okay? Okay. 
Okay, they're cooking and I just add a little bit of water first and you don't have to pour the whole thing in, just a little bit. At the time, if they need some water, you can put some more uh, water. But meanwhile, that's all you're gonna put right now. Then I'm gonna collect, go ahead, scoop that sugar out. And let the sugar melting, okay? Okay, while I wait for this to melt, I go ahead and get my egg prepared. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and um, do a prepare the egg. So let's move over here. Let's take a look here. Get my egg. Let's get the egg ready. Some salt and put some salt in a little bit. A little bit of chicken flavor, not too much, just a little bit. Just to get some, you know, like flavor, a little bit, okay, guy? Okay, let's. Okay, what I do, I do my egg here and just kind of like leave in medium high heat, okay? So it's not gonna get burned, anything like that. I just want slow cook. And then I come back over here. And see this is um, ready all the sugar is melting and the meat is cooked and then we're gonna go ahead put some noodle in okay while you put noodle in don't put the whole chunk at one time just slowly put a little bit half of it first put half and then let the other half soft up a little bit because you want them to mix well so now this one mix well and we go ahead push them to the side and now mix the other half down Okay, see how the noodle is start to be soft, but they're not quite cooked yet. They're still hot, okay? And then this time, you can like check it out. Make sure your noodle cook. If you need to add some more water a little bit to make the noodle cook, do that, okay? I'm just gonna put a little bit. And then take a look at my egg right here on this side. See medium high heat. And I let it cook slowly. So. Okay, see the noodle, everything cooked, but don't worry, they stick together like that. You want to cut it, go ahead, transfer to the big bowl. Any bowl you have, leave it there, let it set until it's cooled down, and then you're going to mix it up with the vegetable and everything else, okay? Okay, and my egg right here is finished, so I'm going to go ahead, turn off the heat, okay? And let it set until it's cooled down, okay? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get all my vegetables prepared, okay? So what I do, I go ahead and use my carrot first. Put the carrot in here because I want my carrot to be kind of like soft. While it's half the heat, you know, so you put your carrot in, it's make it nice and soft. And also help the uh, noodle separate easy too, okay? my 
my spring onion. Cilantro. Then it, this is a uh, sari. Okay, and what I'm gonna do, I'll go ahead put some bean sprouts in the corner. Okay. Egg is already cooled down. See how it's like cut like a thin slice like that, and then you go ahead cut it. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna put this to the side and I'm gonna go ahead and mix the uh, vegetable and the noodle first. See how the noodle is stick together like that? When they cool down, they're easy to separate. That's why I go ahead and get my carrot here. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix the carrot in with the noodle first. Okay. And you kind of go ahead and separate like that. Okay, see, you mix them real good. It's that beautiful color. So pretty and smells so good. Okay, now I go ahead and put some egg in here. See, that's a beef flavor. The beef is taste so good too, guys. Okay, let me go ahead and make me a place, okay? so good all right see dinner is ready guy how easy is that yes lao for me noodle is finished look stir fry noodle is done does that look good mm. I'm ready to test it guys mm -hmm. and this is kind of like a you can do this like party tray, you know, when you have a family and friend come over and it's not hot at all, it's so easy, okay? Let me taste. Mm-hmm. Right. See you guys in the next video, okay? Bye! Black on!